what's going on guys Tyler at RC Madness back in the shop again got another customer build to do today so I figured I would uh, share with you guys um, this one is for a customer um, uh, I want to show you guys what I'm gonna be putting it in um, it is going to be a limitless build of course Arma limitless everybody's pretty familiar with that one at this point awesome car per the customers request we are putting in a Savox, ooh, what is this guy, 1210 uh, servo, and he wanted to go hobby wing, so we're doing max 6 with a 1650. Uh, he wasn't going for all out speed for this build, he wanted some good reliability, and he's going to be running primarily on 6S, so we're going to set him up for a very drivable setup, which I don't know if a lot of guys uh, do this for this car, so I figured it'd be cool to share if you're not looking for ballistic speed. And of course, we're going with the Futaba 4PM, he wanted a little bit. Uh, a nicer radio mid-range not too bad of a price at the current time um, so I'll show you guys that too in the video but I'm gonna throw this together and show you guys the fitment uh, I'm not gonna break it down step by step if you want to see something like that the uh, Arma Typhon buggy I did the roller uh, it's essentially kind of the same setup um, but we're gonna be putting the limitless so I'm gonna go ahead and throw this in then I'll show you guys how I did each one of the electronics how it looks in the car and uh, fitment and stuff like that but uh stick around and uh we'll see what it looks like with all the electronics in the car
have it guys. I got everything installed. Everything fits pretty beautifully. For those of you that are trying to do this setup, no hitches, no cutting, no grinding. Everything fit pretty good. That's with the gear uh, that it came with. That's the larger gear in there, just fit just good. It's the end of the motor mount adjustment. Motor fits in good, no clearance issues. Everything looking good. Um, but yeah, unfortunately I'm not gonna be able to drive this one because it is for a customer. Um, but I figured if people are looking and doing this setup that uh, they kind of want to see it installed. So just forever it helps out there. But anyway, thanks for watching guys. We'll see you in the next build.